Hey G Squad, welcome back to my load of is and Warpin. So today episode we got this cool mid around here and basically what this is, is a waterproof and sandproof blanket that you can also use as a beach mat as well. You can see the one that we got right here is from this brand. And for the one that I got right here is a blue color. They do have this available in other colors as well. So you definitely want to do your own research to see which one you prefer. But you can see the product is super compact when you guys get it. So that way you can fold it back up once you guys are done using it. But I'm just open this up to show you guys what the product looks like first. So once you guys take it out, you can see how it comes with this very nice little bag. But once you guys open it up, this is what the inside looks like. So they probably got you the accessory that you use to stick it onto the grass or the sand and etc. So they probably got a total of four of them. And right here we do have the product. It might be kind of big, so I won't be able to show you guys in the whole entire screen. But let's open it up. So you can see the product is actually very big and it can't fit into the screen. But the way how they designed the product is actually pretty cool because like I mentioned, the material that's on here is sandproof and it's also waterproof. But you can see the way how they designed the product on the corners. They do give you guys an option for you to stick it in like this. So that way you can stick it in the grass or the sand. And then for inside right here, they give you guys the option to put sand or stuff inside right here to hold it down, which is kind of cool. So that way, if you guys don't have sandbags or something, you guys can use that option. But you see the way how they design the product is actually pretty cool. They have like a dark blue color on the side, and the middle part right here, we do have a light blue color. And they do mention the way how they design the product is actually sand free. So once you guys finish using it, you guys can fan it out to get rid of any of the sand if there is any, or the dirt, and etc. But when you guys feel the material on here, it definitely feels very soft and very smooth. And because the material that they use on here is sandproof or waterproof, it is easy for you to clean. And I do mention for the product, you can definitely throw a machine to wash it if you guys do want to. But I do mention for the product, it's oversized. So you can definitely fit like five to eight people on here, which is really big. So obviously I won't have enough space to show you guys right here. But if you guys are curious about what it looks like, it will look something like this once you guys fully expand it. And then once you guys are done using it, you can just fold it back up. So if you guys fold it up by yourself, it might take some time because it is pretty big. But if you guys have help, that would be awesome. But make sure to try to fold it back up right here to show you guys how fast it actually takes to fold it back up. All right, so just like that, and it's all set. And if you guys look right here, these are basically the all four corners where you can stick the actual accessory on to hold it down on the grass or the sand. But once you guys finish folding it up, you can put it back inside. And then tighten it up. And it's all set to use it again next time. And I love the fact that how the product gives you guys this carabiner option, so that way it's hang somewhere to keep it organized as well. But that is everything that's on the product. Now the unboxing and test the product. Now the end question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys are trying to look for some high quality beach blanket. They can also use it as beach mats, but that way people can sit on top. Whether if you guys want to use it for a picnic at a beach or even at a park as well, you can definitely use it how you guys want to. So if you guys want everything that I mentioned that's on here, that I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that should be doing it. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.